the faith of Moses. Hebrews 11, 23 By faith Moses, when he was born, was hidden three months by his parents because they saw he was a beautiful child and they were not afraid of the king's command. Moses' parents were people of faith. They went against the decree at that time and they had faith in God. They believed that their son, you know, at that point, the Hebrew boys were being killed but they trusted God to keep their son and son alive uh, and, and they did everything they could to protect his life uh, and so Moses was a Hebrew boy who was protected during that time and how was that possible through the faith of Moses' parents now, they did not let go of the fact that God you know you are going to establish our family you are not going to you know, cause our, our family to be destroyed, even though, you know, other, other, other families are going through this. But they had faith. And many times we have to have faith uh, to, to get through things that, you know, others um, give up on. And, and Moses' parents had faith. And so Moses was alive. And we continue to read about Moses in, in, from verses 24 onwards. By faith, Moses, when he became of age, refused to be called the son of Pharaoh's daughter, choosing rather to suffer affliction with the people of God than to enjoy the passing pleasures of sin, esteeming the reproach of Christ greater riches than the treasures in Egypt, for he looked to the reward. So by faith, you know, Moses uh, decided, you, you, by faith, Moses had a determination. Uh, Moses could have easily had a great life, you know, he could have had the pleasures in Pharaoh's uh, palace, he, he could have uh, lived a, a great and a lavish life, but he had a determination. How did he get that determination? By faith. By faith, he chose to forsake um, the things that give him that could have given him pleasure and in the same way today we we want to live our lives for Jesus we want to be a witness for Jesus and it can be hard um, you know in the workplace there can be so many things of the world which lure us but by faith we can have the determination to live for God no matter what uh, we we can live and and we can forsake the things that will will lead us to sin uh, and we can just keep fi keep our eyes fixed on the reward that God has for us when we have faith in Him. And Moses was able to do this. And I'm just going to jump to verse 29, which says, By faith they passed through the Red Sea as by dry land, whereas the Egyptians attempting to do so were drowned. By faith, Moses also led the people of Israel. Now just think about this. You have uh, the Israelites who are not uh, a trained army and they are passing through the Red Sea and then you have the Egyptians who are chasing them who would have probably been uh, you know the best. You had the kings and the chariots chasing uh, the Israelites. Both of them you know, when, when they tried to cross the Red Sea it's not that uh, the Egyptians did not have the ability or the skill or the training. The difference is that the Israelites had faith and the Egyptians did not. So what caused the Israelites to cross through the Red Sea but the Egyptians drowned? It was only faith. And Moses led them with that kind of faith. And even this day, we are overcomers because of our faith. We're not saying don't be trained or skilled, but we're saying that faith makes a bigger difference. So let's have faith. Let's pray together. Heavenly Father, we thank you that Lord, through faith, we can conquer. Through faith, we can overcome. And God, I pray that each one of us, oh God, that we will be people of faith, Lord, to overcome, Lord, every scheme, every attack, Lord, every oppression of the enemy. And Father, we declare your victory in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.